All right, kids, it is time for the sermon in a box. And so I'm going to ask you to join me up front. And Junia has enthusiastically brought our sermon in the box this morning. And it's a noisy one. I like it. So let's see what we have. If you're new with us, what we do every week for our children's sermon is we have a child uh, place something in the box. I don't know what it is until I open it. And then I try to draw a spiritual lesson, something we can learn about God or his word uh, from we, what we find in the box. And so we'll see what we have this morning. What we have this morning, this is great, Junia. These are letters. We have some blocks of letters here this morning. Is this from a game or just a, you just, it's from a game in your closet. That's great. You know what? Over the holiday, I played a game that had these tiles as well. It's called Bananagrams. Anybody else play Bananagrams where you have to, you get some random letters and you have to try and spell words with these letters. Let's see. What can we learn from blocks of letters this morning? You know what this reminds me of is, you know, when we play the game, we dump out and you get a bunch of random letters and you try to, you try to make sense of it. You try to take those random letters and you try to make words of them, words that we can understand. And you know what? Life can feel like that. Life can feel sometimes like just a random bunch of letters that doesn't make any sense. And we have think hard things that happen to us and it doesn't make sense. But you know what? God has given us his letters. In the Bible, God has given us letters from him. And he has helped us to understand this world that can seem like just a jumble of letters. And he helps to make sense of it because he has spoken to us in his word. Hey, can we listen up here this morning? He has spoken up uh, to us in his word with the letters that he has placed in the Bible. He has told us about himself and his world. And so we can read the Bible or our parents can read the Bible to us and it can help us to know God and it can help us to know how he loves us and it can help us to know how he wants us to live and how we can have his forgiveness in Jesus. All right. Well, thank you for these many letters this morning, Junia. I'm going to send these.